it's another day. I'm just about ready to go for work, to head out to work, go to work, whatever. Just about ready to go. I think it's going to be a good day. Rain may or may not happen. Hard to say right now. Weather appears to be okay, though. I wish I could see my route. I wish they wouldn't have taken that ability away from us. That's okay. Off to work. I just got home from work a little bit ago, checked the mail, and my portable TV has arrived. The screen, more important. So, yeah, it's just an old VHF, UHF TV. It doesn't work anymore or anything like that. But, just to get an idea for what I'm going for, here's the Atari. And then the screen, I need to hack the screen out of this. But, see, nice four inch screen. Oh, I got fingerprints on it already. Very good. So, yeah. I think this is just the right size. Four inch screen. Uh, the board here is a four by four inch square right now. So it'll be the exact same size as the board when all said and done. Well, not the exact same size, obviously, but you know what I'm trying to say. So I'll be able to fit it in a very small housing. So I'm gonna hack apart the TV now and get the screen out and just make sure I don't break it. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what else we have here. Ah, nope, still not quite yet. I'm trying to find some more screws somewhere. I'm not having any luck though. So, take the battery out and see if maybe there's some hidden screws in there. So far, I've only found three, and one of them was holding that antenna in place. Mm, nothing in the battery compartment, which I think I might salvage. Oop, here we go on the bottom. Might try to... I don't know, the housing on this is pretty good, but I think it's a little bit too bulky. Well, it, I'd like it to be more centered, I should say. It wasn't exactly centered in frame there, was I? Speaking of centered, I found some screws here on the bottom. Let's pop this open. And the speaker, I don't know if I'll use the same speaker out of this or not. I think that's probably what I'll end up doing, it's safe to say, but we shall see. Right now I'm only having difficulty getting into this thing. Tuck on it. There's my razor pen. Oh, here we go. Maybe. <sighs> ah, there we go. All right. Yeah. Well, I decided to switch gears over for now. Atari is just in shambles. <laughs> Yeah, well, more specifically, the Atari screen is in shambles. Atari is still fine. Um, I've switched over to the NES, uh, back over to the Nintoaster. So I'm going to remove the expansion port, remove the RF modulator, and tin the wires. Oh, I might also disable the lockout chip as well. So, yeah. Good stuff, right? I love modding. What a freaking mess. Thankfully, Catherine called me and took me away from my work, so I'm done for the evening. I'm going to clean this up. I'm going to clean myself up and just get ready for bed. It's almost 9 o'clock. It's almost 9 o'clock. No, not almost 9 o'clock. It's almost 9.30, I should say. Hi, Dragon. This is Hyra McDaniel. Say hello, Hyra. Hello, Hyra. And my dragon. So yeah. I'm going to clean up this mess. And get in my pajamas. I'm exhausted. Well, I got some work done as far as the tinkering is concerned. And that's pretty much all the more there was for today, wasn't there? I did have three jobs at work today that went pretty well. Um, got rained on. Like every time I'd go outside and do work. It was raining, and then when I'd stop working, the sun came out. 
go figure. Uh, tomorrow should be a good day, though. I'm looking forward to it, and yeah, we'll just see how it goes. So, I'll see you tomorrow. Sleep well, and good night.